Cops are holding the scene here in this residential neighborhood of Babylon until police can come back here at daylight tomorrow. This after they spent all day today pouring through these woods and missing persons report to try and find some more information on who could have done this and who the victim might be. They're looking specifically at his tattoos because his fingertips were cut off. We find body parts in all the parks around Long Island lately. Teams of forensic investigators working into the night Thursday at Southerns Pod Park in Suffolk County. A young girl and her friends stumbling upon human remains on their way to school in the village of Babylon. She was obviously startled. It wouldn't. It's a little weird to find an arm in the woods. The eighth grader and some friends were first to spot an arm severed at the bicep. They walked to school in like a group together. That person called her father who came to the scene. Um, he then called 911. Canines and cops then uncovering other limbs in separate spots in the 19 acre recreation area surrounded by schools. The superintendent offering support to students after the incident and applauding them for their diligence and reporting the disturbing discovery. We might find the remainder of the of the body. We might not. We don't know until we clear it. The lead homicide investigator telling us at least a left and right arm and leg were likely dumped recently. Whatever happened, it's jarring everybody in the neighborhood and it's kind of like creating like the stir. I don't think it's anything to have to do with this park or this community or this community. And I met briefly tonight with the dad of the girl who made this discovery. He didn't wish to speak publicly, though, at this time because of the whole ordeal was so fresh. Meanwhile, cops are not committing to say whether they think the victim was targeted by a gang or he was the victim of something else.